hi guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here hello welcome make sure to hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so you're notified whenever i post a new video and you do not miss out on great opportunities we share on this channel with that being said beautiful people let's get started <music> Alright beautiful people welcome back so I'm going to show you guys how to find potential palms before they happen okay so you could do it directly here on trading view charts or you could go straight direct to trading view website right you go here where you have the three drop down menu lines and then you select screeners right here you have stock screeners, you have a uh, forex screener, you have crypto screener, stock, you know, heat map and crypto heat map, right? So for uh, let's say crypto, crypto as an example, we select crypto screener, and then you have it here. But we're gonna do it in a better way. We'll go back to trading view chart, so we could kind of compare the screeners to the charts directly okay so the first thing we're going to do is click on filters well where is the filter where is it the first thing you got to do we drag this all the way up like so like so let's see i think this should be perfect okay now you select filters you see it right here and then you see where you have any click on that and choose your platform okay i use coinbase so i select coinbase second you select actually you type here here where you have search filter you type in n d i okay so when you do that you have two um, options here you have the positive directional indicator and then you have the negative directional indicator now you see where you have below you select that and then you change below to cross down okay to cross down then next you see where you have value you select that as well and you click on positive directional indicator we add it here you could close your filter box and just for um, verification just to make sure everything is good you could select it again okay you click filter and you can see here we have the directional um, the negative directional indicator cross down positive directional indicator next so now you can select whichever peer you want to uh, currencies you want to um, screen or check or you know but just to kind of narrow it down we could search usd okay we could search for usd and i'm going to pull this up just a little bit so you guys can see clearly so you see everything we have here is usd usd you know grt usd we have loom versus usd okay so the next thing you want to do is click here where you have technical ratings okay you click on that and that will kind of filter out and rank the ratings by purchasing power i'm going to show you guys an example you see here we have grt usd you could just double click on it let's say we click on this uh, loom okay no let's do grt usd double click on it you see right here it appeared on our chart i'm gonna pull this down a little bit okay and as you guys can see i'm already on the one um four hours i hear people um do this on 15 minutes you know but i prefer four hours because it's kind of more accurate so you see here we have a huge engulfing candle right um 
right here. We have a huge engulfing candle. Okay, at this point, you could start your um, quick charting. You could start your analysis or whatnot. But as you can see, we have a huge, 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 huge engulfing candle. And from here, you could start, um, you know, placing your trade. You could sell. You could accept or reject it. Whatever. But usually here is where you can find potential pumps or a dump. Okay. So for a buy, I double clicked here. Okay. And then you see here we had a huge buy candle that came all the way back here. You do your analysis and then you know, okay, am I going to take this trade or not? Is this um, red candle going to, you know, fill this back up, fill the week and continue up? Or is it going to come down? You can start doing your analysis. Okay. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure to leave a comment in the comment section. If you have any questions, make sure to leave it in the comment section. I'm going to try to answer as much as I can. And also make sure to give this video a thumbs up subscribe to the channel and turn on your notification bell so you do not miss out on our videos okay make sure to check the description because i leave gems in there okay thank you so so much for watching and i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys